The reopening of schools in Ohangwena kicked off on a positive note with all learners having been placed. The region managed to place more than 1,000 grade 12 and 600 grade 10 learners despite being one of the most populated regions in the country after commerce. This was revealed by the Regional Education Director, Esther Kamati, when he visited Oshamono Combined School in a Pembe constituency. Hamati is happy that all children have been placed. Not really. Uh, what is troubling us now is only the learners who are coming back to us because they are not happy with the schools where they have been placed. Otherwise, all our learners, more than 600, have been placed in grade 10. Then you have those who find themselves to have difficulties because some of them have been placed at uh, combined schools with no hostels. Yeah, but uh, our strategy was that at combined schools, only learners from the catchment area who will be placed at that, uh, that school. Only at secondary schools with hostels where you have learners from far away. However, Hamad was quick to point out that the placements of grade 1 in the town of Ailana Fidi is a challenge. Let us work, let us go an extra mile, let us do with what we have. I know resources are limited, mm -hmm. but I also do not know whether the resources will ever be enough. But we have to every time do with what we have. Because the biggest resource in our system, in the education system, the biggest resource is the human being, the human capital. He encouraged learners and teachers to work hard in order to improve on last year's performance. <laughs> Parents have also expressed their gratitude as many of their children were placed, mostly those who are looking for pre grades and grade 10. However, they feel that government should come to their rescue in providing school stationaries. Uh, as far as admission in other grades are concerned, we only have a challenge for grade 1. Uh, in the town of Elauna City. Yeah, but uh, the town of Elauna City, because year in, year out, uh, grade one learners uh, are giving us a problem in that area because the three primary schools which are there, Mtaku Piers, Weyulu Piers, and uh, Nakambuda Piers, are always flooded. And uh, now what we have done is we secured a plot from the town of Elauna City and then we have also registered a school which has been approved by the ED. We have already secured three post teaching posts. Um, however, the biggest challenge is the infrastructure. Osha Monocombined School in a Pembe circuit has about 600 learners. 